education. Some Russellville City School students were back in the classroom. The district is opting for a staggered start, so only a third of students were on campus today. Way 31's Brooke and Terry spoke with the superintendent about the first day back. Superintendent Heath Grimes told me he visited all four schools today and saw all of the students wearing masks. But he said he saw some things that they could improve on too, like social distancing. They didn't social distance the way that I would like for them to social distance. But they are now that we've had a chance to talk with them and to teach them the new protocol and talk to them about directional arrows. And Superintendent Heath Grimes said the school day started with a refresher on safety guidelines. Each grade was split up into small assembly groups for the lesson on how to stay safe from the virus while at school. What social distancing means, the importance of masks, what's going to happen if they're exposed and how it uh, risks us being in school, how it risks their health and safety, how it risks uh, the ability to play football games and band and all of those things that they want to participate in this year. Grimes said it's likely that at some point a student will come down with the coronavirus despite all of the safety precautions. But he hopes the educational moments a student had on their first day helps them realize the severity of the virus and how to take precautions seriously. We put some responsibility on them to make sure they're socially distanced, wearing masks, and uh, sanitizing well. Thursday and Friday, different groups of students will be here in classes. On Monday, the district will double up on its bus routes. Today, students were given uh, little sheets of paper that said if they were in Group A or Group B. In Russellville, Breck and Terry, Way 31 News.